Oh, we've been warning all week not to get too used to the warmer weather we were going to feel today because temperatures would climb and then the roller coaster takes another dip here as we go toward the end of the work week. Let's go ahead and take a look with our Weatherbug Network. Some of the current temperatures we're finding in and around the area. Uh, not too bad still at this hour with some sunshine breaking out. It makes these numbers feel even a little bit warmer. 49 right now in Holland, 45 in Archbold, 47 being reported in Adrian. The numbers got a little warmer farther east of I-75. We were seeing some numbers up into the mid-50s. We still have one right now. 55 being reported in Milan, 50 right now along the lakeshore in Lorraine, 51 in Fremont. So doing pretty good out there at this hour with the sun coming out a bit and the winds will start settling down for us as well. Let's go ahead and take a look with our triple Doppler radar looking around our area scanning all clear. That'll change again as we go into tonight. This system moves out. We've got a little bit of a frontal boundary kind of sitting right along the central part of Ohio, Indiana and uh, Illinois. And what's going to happen is this next system is going to ride right along it. That'll bring some additional showers in as we go into tomorrow morning. So going all the way back to five o'clock this morning with some rain showers falling, we were sitting at 35 degrees and watch the number as we, as we have gone through the day today, we push them up through the 40s, close to 50 now in Toledo. And boy, the warmer air just missed us to the south. 63 right now in Columbus, 66 in Cincinnati. And you get even farther south, they're setting record high temperatures in parts of Arkansas at this hour right now. We'll come in and take a look at our TrueView forecast. I want to show you this because this really emphasizes that we're going to stay in the cool weather here as we head through the overnight. With temperatures falling down into the 30s, here come those rain showers. So we'll stay dry through a lot of the overnight, but as we get closer to sunrise, showers moving back into the area, but the cold air will still be in place as well. So watch what our true view forecast starts to do. It starts to change that over to snow as we go through the uh, morning hours, but then the precipitation cuts off again as we get toward midday. Now the cooler air really starts to move back in and temperatures will fall off yet again going through Thursday night and into Friday morning. And as we go into Friday afternoon, some residual moisture and some cooler air se uh, seeping down from the north will get us into some, uh, yeah, some additional snow flurries, it looks like, as we go through our Friday afternoon. Well, again, today is NBC 24 Weather Kid Day, so we're going to bring in TJ Tursky. TJ is from Rossford, Ohio. Come on in. Come on in a little closer. There he is. He's now in the screen here. Did you have anyone at home you wanted to say hi to? Any friends, family? Not necessarily at home, but I just wanted to say hi to my awesome princi principal, Mr. Dress Jeff Taylor, oh. and I also wanted to say hi to all the Eagle Point kids Ooh. watching me right now. Awesome, cool. They were pretty happy for you when you got selected, huh? Mm -hmm. So uh, does that get you a couple free hall passes from the principal since you called him out on TV and said <laughs> hi and everything? No, no, you no. still got to play by the rules, huh? Well, TJ is going to walk us through the forecast here, so take a step back, look at the screen, TJ, tell everyone at home what to expect through tonight. So, um, tonight what was uh, mostly cloudy overnight showers. The high is 35 degrees. Ah, the low overnight the will be low. 35 degrees. That's all right. Hey, tell them about tomorrow. It doesn't look uh, all that great, but I guess not all that bad either. The high is 43 degrees. Early showers or a mix, partly sunny in the p.m. Yeah, so we get a little bit of sun in the afternoon, maybe a few snow flurries in the morning. As we end the work week and go into the weekend, it gets a lot colder. Tell them what to expect starting with Friday. Friday, some more flurries in the p.m. hours. The high is 32 degrees. The low is 22 mm -hmm. degrees. Saturday and Sunday, pretty chilly out there. Yeah, Saturday is pretty chilly. The high is 34. The low is 16. And Sunday, we're looking at more, more showers in the p.m. hour. Uh -huh. High, the high is 46 and the low is 18. 18. So Monday it's still a little bit cool, but hey, what can we look forward to as we get into the middle section of next week? Tuesday, the high is in the 50s, partly sunny. Wednesday in the 60s mm -hmm. for the highs. Um, partly sunny with some... At, some um, Rain showers. Yeah, maybe a few showers there as we get back into the middle of next week. But temperatures will be a little warmer, so I don't think anyone will complain too much. Come on in a little closer. you got one more job that you got to do here before you're all done. You have to look into the camera and you say, Laura and Jim, back to you. Laura and Jim, back to you.